Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's that boy G playing. Don't give a damn. He cooler than the fan. Walking real tall. Some say he's man. It's all good, though. We out here, David G. We in Baton Rouge right now, man. What's going on with you, dog? Um, you all right today? You good? Yeah, I'm good. I'm alive, so I'm good. Hey, you right about that. You right about that. So I want I want to get straight into it, man. You from Baton Rouge? Yeah, I'm from BR. Yeah, what part of Baton Rouge are you from? From uh, East Baton Rouge. East Baton Rouge, and like, and like, how how was it like growing up in East Baton Rouge for you? Um, I mean, it was straight. Um, I don't really know what to say about it. Man, it's, it's whatever you want to say. You know what I'm saying? It's whatever you want to say. Like, I mean, it's BR. It ain't the best place, but I still love it. You know, it's, it's my city, so it's where I'm from. Yeah, yeah. You're right about that. You're right about that. So, you know, you shoot videos for some people who don't know. I mean, I, I'm i pretty sure a lot of you do know, but for, for the viewers who don't who don't know, you shoot videos, you're a videographer or whatever. Like, when did you start shooting videos? As far as music videos, I've been doing about four years now, mm -hmm. but as far as just having the camera, I've been doing that my whole life. Mm -hmm. Like as a kid, shooting skateboard videos, mm -hmm. just little home movies, whatever. I've like been, it's been my dream. Mm -hmm. Really, my real dream is to shoot movies one day. That's that's the real goal right there. Mm -hmm. Sure, you will. You yeah, will. it's coming. You know? And I want to say this, man, all right. Change your plans, put out a list about a month ago. You were featured on it. A lot of different video albums are featuring on it. Look, actually, I had to tell you about that because y'all spelled my name wrong on there. Oh, yeah? Well, hey, tell <laughs> hey, it's all good. Hey, like, you make mistakes. You make mistakes. But, but the thing the thing was, the overall goal was it like, right now, the city of Baton Rouge and I'm going to say South Louisiana, right now, the whole world is just gravitating toward the artists out here. And if it wasn't for these video articles, these shooters, I wouldn't have found y'all, all the other blogs wouldn't have found y'all, and I feel like y'all deserve all the, all the, you know, the recognition and the, and the notoriety for doing the work, you feel me, so, how did you, how did you feel about the overall, besides your name being spelled wrong? I mean, I think it's cool, uh, putting a spotlight on, mm -hmm. you know, we got a lot of talent in Louisiana, mm -hmm. music, filmers, producers, mm -hmm. so I mean, it was cool to see, uh, you know, I know a lot of those people on the list, so yeah. it was cool to see all of them. Yeah. I feel on that. I feel on that now. You, you shot most of most of the the emerging artists coming out the city. Most of them, I would say. Yeah, at one point or another, I probably shot a video for pretty much everybody. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And right now, two of the of the hottest artists coming out the state, of course, NBA YoungBoy and Jada Younger. It's probably others. So, but right now, like, what, what, what do you think your, your most your most notable video out right now? I mean, as far as my favorite video, mm -hmm. I did for Young Boys called No Smoke. Mm -hmm. Right now, that's my favorite. Mm -hmm. It's like 50 million views. Mm -hmm. It's on BET Jams, too. Yeah, shout out to you, man. Let me tell you something. Everybody want a video by David G. Man, I gotta get in touch with David G. Man, I gotta get a shot by David G. Like, what does it take? Well, like, what does it take for an artist to get shot by David G? I, I, I'm curious. Uh, two thousand dollars. <laughs> two thousand dollars straight up. Like, I, you know, I'm not with the picking and choosing. Like, if they come with the money, I'm gonna shoot the video. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Two. So y'all heard it, people. Two thousand. Straight up. You feel me? Straight up. But right now, man, like, like I say. You got these a couple artists that that's getting they getting worldwide buzz. I even saw you featured on. Um, I saw Double XL picked up um a, a few of your videos as well. Oh yeah, them the Fader. Uh, I like all of them. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm trying to think. There was another magazine. Oh, uh, Noisy mm -hmm. Vice. They mm -hmm. wrote about me too. Mm -hmm. Man, we still over here like God, me. Hey, it is what it is though. You know what I'm saying? It's worth it. You know what I'm saying? Right now. I mean, I'm finna hit 300k subscribers on YouTube. It's like you getting a video and exposure, so mm -hmm. they got people charging more than me that don't even have the YouTube. So mm -hmm. I mean, really, it's a deal to me. Mm -hmm. I mean, have you have you ever got hey you too high? Yeah, you people get mad sometimes, but it is what it is. Someone else is gonna pay it, so. Mm -hmm. 
thing on. So, uh, right now, what's the what's the what's the thing that you love most about shooting video? I just like not working in the office or like going to the same place every day. It's something new every day. Mm -hmm. and I like to travel. I get to go to Cali, Miami, New York. It's probably my favorite traveling. Oh yeah. yeah. And I'm pretty sure you get to see all the other big, all big names and, and stuff like that as well. I mean, I don't really care about all that. Mm -hmm. Hey, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. Well, I want to say this too, man. Any rapper, whoever, like, what advice do you have for them who want to get into this music game? First of all, you got to know you're going to have to spend money. Like, regardless, you got to know, like, people think they could just shoot one video and they're going to be famous. But, I mean, it takes time, money. And skill too. I mean, it's, you know, it's not for every. Just like pro football, any of that, like, it's not for everybody. Mm -hmm. But I mean, as far as some advice, um, I mean, I guess you gotta just keep grinding. I mean, it took me four years before people even cared about what I was doing. Four years? Pretty since like 2013. People just now starting to actually pay attention. Mm -hmm. At least I almost you gave up too. Well, talk so about that's the, I mean, I'm just saying, like, it just takes dedication, no matter what you do. So at the point when you when you was about to give up on your on your dreams, like, what, what was going on during the time? Why did you want to give up? Mostly because, like, I was struggling just to pay my bills and all that. All right, because I used to work at this place, Tommy's Seafood, mm -hmm. and sure, I just wasn't making no money there, and they fired me, and after that, I just all my dreams and so at first it was slow and I, you know I was struggling that's why I, I didn't even really believe in myself mm -hmm. and it's just like man I'm about to just give up everything I was gonna go uh, try and get a job at the plant or something mm -hmm. quit smoking weed and everything <laughs> that's another thing <laughs> I can't <laughs> oh, yeah you <laughs> listen, listen there, no, you spoke this day. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good, but I want to say this, man. What video you think that made the people like really take your craft seriously? Um, I mean, the first video I hit a million was with Mr. Kane. Mm -hmm. This was a long time ago. It was called I Tried. Mm -hmm. and that's when people first really heard about me around here. Mm -hmm. But video? my biggest video that really did something was with Young Boy 38 Baby. Yeah. That's the one that really. I mean, that was dope. That was yeah, that, that's the one that took me. I want to ask you about this too, man. Speaking of NBA Young Boy, how how was the relationship between you and NBA Young Boy? You know, everything shot by David G. Everything shot by David. Like, I was. I mean, what's I, mean, that's, like? I mean, we do work, but that's my friend too. You know, mm -hmm. he's like a brother to me. Mm -hmm. Like y'all do besides well basically besides music it's it's more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean they pretty much uh took me into the to the NBA family, so I mean I feel like they adopted me almost. Mm -hmm. Right now, all right. 2017, I mean, years over with. A couple more couple weeks within 2018. Do you have any changes or any upcoming things you can speak about? Do you wanna speak about? Any change? What do you mean? Like change? any change, you know? Like everybody say, well, we got New Year's resolution. This year. Alright, shit, sure. you better get the videos now because it's only going up from here, so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this yeah. was a good year, so I, get, I don't know what's going to happen next year. Uh -huh. You know, I just, uh, the biggest thing I did to finish this year was shooting a video with Youngboy and Kodak Black. Yeah. So yeah. that was a good way to end the year. Yeah, we saw it. We was, was going crazy. We talked about that earlier. That's why I passed it or whatever. But like, how how was that? You were you in Florida when you done that? Is yeah, that we you? flew to. Uh, that was at Kodak's house. He brought mm -hmm. us to his house. Wow. I mean, him and Youngboy already were friends before, but that was I mean, that was my first time going over there. Mm -hmm. right, I want I want to say this right now. Jetty Young, he popping. He, he doing his thing. I saw him through you. Do y'all have a relationship as well? Alright, well first of all, a lot of people think he's from BR, but he's not even from Baton Rouge. He's from Bogalusa. Yeah, he's from Bogalusa. Yeah. 
and uh, I know he doesn't like that. A lot of people keep saying he's from the yard. But uh -huh. For me, as far as him, he's gonna blow up. He just uh, he got a out, like a mixtape on the way, yeah. and uh, he got a bunch of record labels calling him now. I mean, he's doing his thing. He's doing his thing. For real, is it? Is it? Is it any other artists that that the world should be looking out for besides those two? Well, he got uh, Jay the Young and him, and he has another dude that raps with him, Famous. Yeah, G Famous. I heard he, famous uh, yeah. We just put a video out like two weeks ago and it's at 400,000, so we finna hit a mill, so. Mm. Um, I'm trying to think, you put yeah, me so on the spot right now. <laughs> every video you shoot you on platinum? Not everyone, but I'll probably, I'll probably hit a mill at least like 30 times. Golly, that's crazy, that's crazy. Golly, you just shoot everything. That's my job. Hey, hey, ain't nothing wrong with it. Someone's gotta do it. Yeah, ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. So right now, like, like what's your what's your overall goal with this camera stuff? I mean, you hitting million views, you making money, you traveling the world. Shooting movies, man, that's a dream, like I said before. That's the next step. Mm -hmm. Have you started yet? Have you no, I started I actually started writing a movie and then that iPhone broke, so the whole movie script's gone. Wow. Because the iPhone broke, so I should have wrote it on paper or something probably, but yeah. that kind of discouraged me, so I put it on hold. Then all this, I'm so busy with the music videos, mm -hmm. so I just need someone to kind of inspire me. I don't know. So you need somebody to inspire you? To do the movie. Yeah. I mean, I believe in you. I know, but I need like someone to do it. Like, I don't know any actors, I don't, you know. Man. I know how to shoot music videos. I know I can shoot a movie. I just need the team. Mm -hmm. yeah. like, I can shoot a music video by myself, but a movie, I need the team. I feel like this, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I'm from North Louisiana. I'm from Natchez. I be, I go different places, shoot interviews, interview artists consistently for about two years now. I don't, I mean, I'm like, you David, you David G. If you if 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 I mention your name to someone up there, they gonna say, man, that David G, like he shooting all this. I feel like like if you want it, just say it. You got a platform. Hey, look, I'm looking for movie writers. I'm looking for people, filmmakers. I'm looking for models. I'm looking for actor actresses. I, you can do it. I I, I think you can. But. I know, but it's also about having the time to do it. I'm so busy. So what's your what's your schedule like? I know I know you said you work on weekends. Is that what you told us? Oh yeah. Like? There ain't no weekends. There ain't no holidays. If someone books a video. I'm shooting the video. So like, how many how many like videos you shoot a week? You think? At least three. Like minimum, I'm trying to shoot at least three videos a week. Mm -hmm. And before we stop earlier, would you inform the people like 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 how much how much work goes into this stuff? Some people just say, oh, we just did a camera press. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, First of all, I'm going to show up to shoot the video. That's going to take about anywhere from three to eight hours just to film the video. Like, depending on if people show up on time, mm -hmm. you know, whatever. And then it's going to take about twice that much to edit it. So, mm -hmm. I mean, people don't really understand. Like, young boy's going to, we're going to shoot a video. He's going like, to be like, you got it done tonight? Like, you want to edit it tonight, too? I'm like, dude, you can't. What? <laughs> like, most of those videos I put out for him, they've been edited in about two, three hours, because he puts me, uh... You put that pressure on, you can get it out. <laughs> like, I mean, we got fan he got fans waiting to see it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I saw, we got dropped so many clips for last week? Week before that? I don't know, but I shot that video, and, and then it dropped the next morning. Yeah, it went, it went crazy. It went crazy.